Good morning, everybody. It's me, Diamond Z, and we're back with more Stardew Valley. Episode 3, day 4. Remember, we did two uh, days last episode, so, you know, we're on day 4 now. Uh, hopefully, the mines have cleared up. If they haven't, then I don't know what we're gonna do today. What's tomorrow looking like? It's gonna be sunny. I think it's also sunny right now. Spirits are in good humor. I like that. Back on the tip. Check for spring onions southwest of town, where the river meets the ocean. You can sense there's a whole bunch growing right out of the dirt. Right. So, we shall go check that out momentarily. Let's go ahead and water everything, because, well... It's not raining, sadly. But you know what? We'll make do with it. So I guess we'll go, uh, south, south, and look for the, uh, spring onions, I suppose. Alright. What's our rice doing? That's doing alright. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to, there we go. Refill the water. Um, yeah, let's just go south, see if we, can, we can't find these, uh, spring onions. Get out of my way. Uh, I guess another thing I can do is just look around for some forage. Alright. Could do a little bit of fishing as well. No, I should probably get more seeds, because we have money. Oh, here we go. Get some forage. Dandelion and a horse rudish. Oh, uh, the river meets the ocean. I suppose it's the river. We got more forage up here, though. We got more mixed seeds. Okay, we'll plant that when we get back. Ooh, this, this house here looks abandoned. Unfortunate, to be honest, it's really unfortunate. I think we can all blame it on one uh, individual or a group of individuals. <clears throat> Looking at you, Morris, and the rest of Joe Jamart. Um, you see any spring onions? Cause I don't. So the river meets the ocean, we're here. Oh, here we go. Got a couple of them. Spring onions. I don't think that's the way that's supposed to sound. Because that's liquid. It's locked. Darn. It's hoping to go in the sewers. Wonder what kind of fish would be in there. Probably nothing, because it's all dookie. But you know what? It's always worth a shot, right? Uh, let's head into, uh, let's head into town. And just do our daily chats with people. Maybe give out some gifts, because we do have dandelions and a horseradish. 10 a.m. Oh, we can get more seeds, actually. We should probably do that, actually. Oh, hi, Penny. We're very lucky to have a library in such a small town. When you're less than a book, it's easy to forget the realities of your life. Maybe that's why I like reading so much. Well, it can't be that bad. Sorry, I got carried away there. Oh, okay, you just got carried away? Ah, oh, that's, that's fine then. <laughs> I was eyeing up the trash. <laughs> Feeling gloomy. Parsnip might cheer me up. Sebastian. I don't know when our parsnips will be up. Actually, I guess I could, uh, check the ears real quick. If they're ready tomorrow, then I can give one to Sebastian. It takes four days to mature. Okay, they'll be ready tomorrow. We'll accept that quest for you, Sebastian. Should I get more cauliflower? I might actually get beans. It takes 10 days. We're on the 14th. Let's be ready on the... Well, actually, no, it won't be around the, on the 15th, because it takes a day to... It takes the first day to grow as well. Um... So, I get four beans. I guess I could dump the rest in the collies. I have 20 left. Oh, my inventory's full. Um. Buy my. We'll get a jazz seed. We'll buy my spring onions. Nobody's out. Oh, let's talk to him, actually. Here! Let's chat. I'm 
happy to buy any products off you. I'll give you a fair price, of course. Fair enough. I'm down for a fair price. Let's go through some trash. Ah. Nothing. Come on. There's gotta be something. Hi, Alex. They're starting to warm up. I'm feeling pumped. You are a sports guy. Daffodil. Let me get that. No, oh, I can't. Um, let's go plant, and then we'll come back for that. So I was about to start fishing too, and I was like, well, and then, and then I, you know, I just realized I can't do that just yet. It's Haley. Hi, Haley. Oh, you're that new farmer boy, aren't you? Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. Mm, if one for those horrendous clothes, you might actually. Okay, that's kind of rude. Give someone a gift. Not giving it to you because you're a bit uh. You know. Before yourself. Hi, Lewis. The sun can get pretty lively at night. Sometimes we even put a coin in the jukebox. Hehe. <laughs> like to visit once a week or so to catch up on things anyway. Who should I give a gift to? Because we've met everybody. Uh, yeah, cultivate harvest a partisan, but I need to bring Sebastian one of my parsnips. I need to give somebody a gift. Actually, I can do that all at the same time. Give Sebastian the parsnip, which will count as a gift, I think. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah. We'll see, we'll see if that works. Should. I want to make seeds. No, I'm going to, uh... Hit all of these bushes here, see if I can get more mixed seeds. Okay, we'll go that way. It's blocked. A whole lot of nothing. Isn't that just fantastic? I'll put our beans right here. Beans there. Put my jazz right there. Plant those. Uh, mix seeds and get them all watered. And this is all collies. It's all watered. Dandelions, eat a horseradish, because why not? Right. Might as well, it gives me energy. I'm gonna eat both of them. Um, let's refill the watering can, too. Yep. Uh, let's fish for a little bit. 2 p.m. Yeah, let's go fishing. I'm gonna put the background music. I'm gonna put some background music on here. I'm gonna make it very low volume. Okay, never mind. I won't do that. Let's just check in the calendar. Caroline and Jody. Hello. I wonder if I can get Pierre to cook dinner tonight. Try it. Find out. Is there a farmer, huh? Interesting. I've never met a farmer before. Surely you have. Hi, Vincent. I'm hungry. Where's mom? Just over there. Promise. She's just over there. Oh, ah. Oh. Adam. Let's do a little bit of fishing. If I get enough experience, I can get a bunch of good fish. Sunfish. Come over here. What we got? What we got? What we got? 
Need something good. Oh, you're. Oh. <laughs> oh, gold star sunfish. Nine inches. Not bad. I like that. Let's go into the beach for some fishing instead. I feel like it'll be way better. Actually, is there anything around for me to. Worms! Bam! Clay. Ooh, bubbles. I don't think- I can't reach that. Well, they just went away anyway. Oh, hey, Lily! He's gonna fish right on top of me. Good luck, buddy. A herring. Fish over here instead. Should be alright. Might as well, right? Actually, hello, Willy. <laughs> eh? I'll tell you about my thoughts, but it's a fisherman's secret. <laughs> Newspaper. I'm out of this giant. Worms. Wham! Play. Stinking play. 7 p.m. Let's see if we get anything new out of the river. Have to. There's no way we don't. Yeah, okay. Algae. Sure, why not? <sighs> ah, mamma mia. Come on. Surely there's something new. There has to be. Some kind of knife fish, maybe. Like Lily said, some fish only come out at night. It's now night. Newspaper. That's what comes out at night. But where are the newspapers? Especially if they're soggy. Beware. Eh! <laughs> Come on. Ah, here we go. What we got? Perfect catch. Bream. I'm not carrying a sunfish around town. I'm doing that. Oh. It's kind of rough in here. Business has been slow lately. Shop your tools. Could use the cash. What do you want? Leave me alone. Well, Clint, if you want me to get my tools, I gotta get to the mines. But you know what? There's a ding dong in there, or up there, trying to cut it with a stinking hammer. I can't bust it with a pickaxe for whatever reason. I'm looking forward to this beverage all afternoon. <laughs> Hey, you look like you could use a beverage. Hyper farming in a sustainable way. The value's ecosystem is fragile. How do I know? I have a strong gut feeling. Go wild, I guess. I don't know. It's very dark. <laughs> oh, me. If I can get to bed by, like, almost... Just about 10, I should be able to refill my energy to about full here. 32, let's see, I, w I went to bed at like 10 with like almost no energy and got 136, so... Should be alright. Bream, herring, sunfish, sunfish. So we can get that and put the clay in there, organize it a little bit. In the meantime, I'll check how much time we've got going on us here. 
157. Didn't make as much, but you know what? That's alright. How much how, how much are we going here? 15. Going again. Two days. <laughs> it should be harvest day for the parsnips, right? What's tomorrow looking like? Rain. Spirits are neutral today. Wasn't well, that just a treat? Oh, hey, it's Marnie. Hi, Marnie. Hello, Diamond Z. You see this dog here? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I don't sit outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray, poor thing. It's unfortunate. It has a collar, though. Seems to like this place. Hey, um, don't you think it's Frankie's a good dog? Of course I'll adopt the dog. What? Well, name it after mine. Oops. Bailey. Well, Bailey, you be a good pooch now, okay? She'll be fine. If she's anything like my... If she's anything like my Bailey, she'll be perfectly fine. And it's parsnip day. Stinking... Crow! I need a scarecrow. To our value, Jojo, my customers. Our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal. Pursuant to... Initiative L61091 Joja Kill Amendment. Responsible stewardship of the local environments are top priority. My bootay! We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As always, we value your we value your continued support and patronage. Morris! Joja Customer Satisfaction Representative. Stick it up yours! Anyways, we got 15 parsnips. <laughs> Oh, we're still farming level one and make a scarecrow. Build a coop. That's gonna take a while. We got money for harvesting a parsnip. Uh, and that's to bring Sebastian a parsnip today, so we'll do that too. And now, since the mines are open, we can head inside. Where's my good girl at? Where is she? Bailey. <laughs> I say that too loud. She's actually can come walking up here. Where is she? Oh, she's on the floor. Hello. I gotta be careful saying her name too loud. She might come up here. Well, we got music, and I like this. It doesn't have to be deathly silent. I'm gonna burp in a minute. Ugh. Ugh. That wasn't nice. That was not pleasant. Um. Team parsnips. There were 16, but a crow ate this one. Like a. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> I feel like this will be another 30 minute video if I don't time lapse some of it. Look for some porridge up here. Whole bunch of nothing, like always. We gotta bring Sebastian a parsnip today. See if we can't get up there. He's. He lives with Robin. Hi, Lewis. Oh, hi there. Hello. Do it, do it, do it. What an eyesore. Looks pretty run down. This is the Pelicaton Community Center. What's left of it anyway? This would be the pride and joy of the town. Always bustling with activity. Looks like a mess now. Now? Look at it. It's shameful. These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. But listen to me. I sound like an old fool. Ah. The George Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so I can turn it into a warehouse. I'll get the the money, but there's something to stop me from selling it. You also, towers like me get attached to relics of the past. Oh well. If anyone else buys a George Co. membership, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell it. Nah. <sighs> Here, let's go inside. Anyone else buys a Joji Co. membership, I will personally go to their house and beat the cr All right, let me stop. What is that? It looks like a hut. Yeah, what is that? Hmm? What's this? 
I guess Vincent and Jess must have been playing in here. How could they have gotten in here? You said the door was locked. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. What? Hey, Lewis, turn around. What? I said turn around. What's the matter? Are you ill? No, there was something right there. You saw something? Hmm. Wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. Turn around! Right now! You're worrying me, Diamond Z. Look, I think I'm gonna head home. I need some lunch. Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can... Maybe you can help catch that rat if you have some extra time. Funny. Funny, you funny guy you are. Strange. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. Yes, I will. Actually, I guess I can do that right now. Oh, here we are. Let's go inside. Oh, there's a light down here. I just want to look at the place first. This tile floor was just like a kitchen or some sort. What's this? Ooh. Oh, there's a guy. That's in a language I don't understand. Interesting. Um, let's see if we can find Sebastian real quick. We'll come back around at some point. Let's clear this up too. The fiber there. <sighs> um. Yeah, let's go up to the mines. Actually, I guess I could check on uh, Sebastian and see if he's. Hi, Robin. Hey, where's Sebastian at? I have his parse new. You might have seen Sebastian, right? He lives downstairs. A little shy, but I'm sure it'll warm up to you if you're nice to him. He lives downstairs, huh? He's in bed. Sebastian, I have your parsnip. Right here. Come and get it. That's not what I want to do. I want to eat the parsnip. See? Delicious. We'll come back later. <laughs> Hi, Demetrius. Robin has a hot temper. It's better to stay on her good side. Don't tell her I said that. <laughs> hey, hey, uh, never mind. Hmm. <clears throat> oh, hey, Linus. Please don't destroy my tent. It's happened before. It's cozy. I don't know why I would want to destroy it. Here we go. Mines. Down this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a, but a dark place, undisturbed for so long. I'm afraid ore is the only thing you'll find. Here, take this. You might need it. Ah, we got a blade! A rusty sword. Got a blade. Name's Marlin, by the way. Or when the adventures go right outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself, and I might think about making you a member. Well, let's head on down. The mines, the mines. Okay, we'll just dig around. Because we have to dig to find the ladder down to the next level. Oh, there we go. Well, we got ores. Papa! There's our ladder down. There's boxes. Smack them, they'll give you stuff. At least they should. Not like give me rocks. Now we have our health bar, so. We'll have to wash ourselves here. A geode! 
Found a geo. The local blacksmith can break it open for you. Who knows what might? <laughs> Who knows what might be hidden inside? <laughs> a bug. There's a bug. Kill it. Ooh, what's that? Door scroll Uno. Found an artifact. The curator of the local museum might want to know about this. This made me instantly drop my rocks. Just kick the fiber. Don't need it. What's this? Inventory's full. Gosh dang it. Topaz. Die, bug. Kappa. More topaz. Fantastic. I have enough, uh, sap. So, doing the mines, this is definitely something all time lasts, for sure. Just trying to find, like, the ladder and stuff. Speaking of which, did I already find it, or... Did I not? I already found it. Did I find it down here? No. Yep, yeah, because this will get old real quick. I promise you that. Oh, there it is. Level 4. Gonna get a lot of copper. Try to find our way down, too. Get a portion for some energy. Getting the rocks would be good, too, but I don't have, like, space. Should've bought that backpack upgrade. It's alright. We'll manage. There's our ladder. There we go. Deeper in the mine. Here's level 40. Visit Gunther. How about no? Slime! Got our first en enemy! And when they hit you, obviously they'll do damage, so, you know, you gotta watch your health there. Oh, we got a crit. Seeing the slime comics makes me want to play Slime Rancher. I should buy the new game, actually. I really should buy Slime Rancher 2. Do that one. Come here. Come here, Slimey. He dead. Hi, bug. It's a box. Nothing. Not even a piece of wood. More topaz. That's money. I can donate one to Gunther and then sell the other two. What's in here? Piece of wood. Is there a ladder down here? Yes, it is. Level 7. I mean, I guess we could go for level 10, right? Let's do it. Time lapse. Go. Actually, never mind. We're almost out of energy. I got parsnips, never mind. Time lapse is a go. Cherry bomb. You know what? Let's blow some stuff up. Kaboom. Level 10. Leather boots. Put that on. I got leather boots. Plus one defense and plus one immunity. Fantastic. Alright. Let's go to Sebastian first. To give him the parsnip. I see if he's out of the house. Or at least out of his room. Out of his room is more preferable. It doesn't have to be out of his house, it's at least out of his room. Let's see, is he out of his room yet? He is. He's not in his room. So where is he? He's not in the kitchen. You know, he's not even here. I guess I could 
uh, go to Gunther, donate these two things, and then camp outside oh, his house. Oh, a saloon is busting! Oh, there's Sebastian. Uh, 6 p.m. on a Friday, he's in the saloon. Hey, thanks for the help, this is just what I wanted. Shall I send win for once? Nah. Delivery done. Give someone a gift. Alright. <sighs> I'm not very good. Hmm. If I give the cue ball a bit of a tough spin, maybe I could... Okay, you're gonna repeat yourself multiple times over and over. Wow, well, I just realized it's Friday. Sometimes I totally lose track of time. So do I. Oh, didn't mean to put my blade in your face. Hi, Shane. Don't you have work to do? No, it's a Friday. Handling salty fish all day makes me real thirsty. Handling... Okay. I'm working hard all week. I deserve a little relaxation on a Friday night. Okay. I think everyone's gonna repeat themselves. Good evening. It's nice to see you socializing with the townsfolk. It's good to stop by once in a while and see what the latest news is. Morning doesn't seem to notice that you're there. Is she out of it? Oh, you guys, give me another pint to your strongest. <laughs> Business has been really good tonight. I'm pleased. Ah, spring, the season of pastels. I actually prefer jewel tones myself. Oh, excuse me. I was mumbling about fashion again, wasn't I? What? Hello, Elliot. The fresh air of this valley is good for body and mind. A quick stroll outdoors always invigorates me. <laughs> Hi, Leah. It's simpler to be friends with the trees. They don't have much to say. I'm a parsnip. It's a really nice gift. Thank you. Bam. More, more money. Just for giving a gift. Ah. Where's Penny? Hi, Penny. If you dig in the dirt, you can find some interesting things. On top, I found a really old piece of pottery. I brought it to Gunther and he said it was over a thousand years old. That is crazy. Well, speaking of which, can I even get to his uh, place in time? I should have gone there first. It's 8 p.m. Do you think it's still open? Oh, it closes at 6. Oh, oh. Alright. Won't be doing that then. Definitely won't be doing that. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna sell all the parsnips. Upper ore, geo, dwarf scroll, one topaz. So I'll have these ready for tomorrow. And I'm gonna sell these other three. Let's see where that gets me. 9 p.m. How long are we going for? 36. Um. Yeah, I probably should get my health and energy back up. Bailey's in front of the fire sleeping. Level 1 farming. Nice. Plus 1 watering camp proficiency, plus 1 hoe proficiency. We can make a scarecrow and basic fertilizer. Oh, we can make a cherry bomb with level 1 mining. Fantastic. Okay. Alright. 520 gold. Day 6. We shall pick up here... On the next episode, it is raining! So what it looks like outside. Oh, Clint's here! Oh god. Oops. <laughs> um, my bad. Yeah, didn't mean to do that one. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll pick up here, uh, in the next episode. I'll get that whole cutscene again. So. Yep. Smash like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next episode. Take care. Goodbye.